going on? Welcome in. Come on, come on, come on in. All right, we got a channel message. Let's get it. Okay, so something can be really complicated to you or seem difficult, but if you actually challenge yourself, push yourself, you're going to gain success in this. This is worth the investment is what I'm hearing. This is worth the investment. High priestess of fire, connecting to the fire element. Also, you're very powerful and you could be very impulsive. I feel like that might help you. Because why did I just say that? That's going to help you. Be impulsive. Because the more you sit in denial, the more you tell yourself, oh, this is too complicated, it's too challenging, I can't, no, 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 no. The further away from the success you go, right? But the more that you say, you know what, fuck that shit. I'm, you know, invoke this fire energy that, that they're talking about that you have, right? It breathes, it breathes success for you, okay? For something coming up, strength right behind it. Can't make it up. Vision right behind it. Let's get into it, y'all. Let's get into it. All right. That's what they came up here, too. Yeah. So this is like the counter energy, the type of energy that you need. This is just actually going to pull it off. Be impulsive. I don't feel like be irrational, but be impulsive. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, fuck it. I'm just going to go for it. You know? That type of impulsive, right? Plan methodically, whatever you want to do. Structure and just go for it. Boom. Boom, right? Is the vibes. Tell me more about this reading. Yeah, let's see. What else? Let's dive a little deeper here. Yeah, we got the Ten of Pentacles. Something that's going to be extremely successful. You have no idea. So you just got to get out of your way, out of your own head. Okay, Eight of Pentacles. This is totally worth. It's salt. It's worth the squeeze, right? Come on. Ace of Wands. All right. You just got to find the proper energy. All right. And that's what they said. That's where it's going to come from. That passion, that fire, that impulsivity, that, that just, oh, you know, that spark. Right. Something's definitely waiting to happen in your life. Okay. With this transformation. Okay. You have no idea. Okay, so don't be afraid because there's success behind it. Okay, five of swords, and then your mental conflict with this because you probably have known for a while that this change is gonna bring you the success that you wanted, but you may have been uh, afraid to face something. You know what I'm saying? You weren't using your intelligence. You know what I'm saying? You were letting something hold you back, right? Maybe you were chasing money. Maybe it was money. Maybe it was finances. Maybe it was all these things you were hiding behind that said, maybe I'm going to stop whatever my idea of success is and chase this other thing. I don't know, right? But whatever it was, you know, two of pinnacles, you're learning how to balance all of these things. So there may have been other things that could have been in your way. You know, maybe sort of trying to block you at this time. But I feel like things are starting to change for the better to make things more possible. As I see this hand, like, reaching for the grape. So something's coming closer so you can actually grab it. You know what I'm saying? Actually, like, reach it. Yeah, Queen of Cups. Energy. Okay. Maybe you had to hell out a, a particular personal perspective angle the way that you approached um yourself and addressing goals in your life um setting goals uh things of that nature right so the hangman right you're finding a new energy and a new direction you know what i'm going to do something different right and boom there it happens for you 
right? Three of Cups celebration. So it does happen. Whatever this was for us getting this channel message, um, despite how afraid you are, you're going to get some help and some support. Three of Pentacles, you're going to be able to um, overcome this obstacle, okay? And you're going to be celebrating in success. Okay, no matter how challenging and difficult this is, you're going to overcome it because that's just what it is. For this reading is what I'm taking up. Okay, so let me know how you like this reading down below. You know what? Let me get some answers, some um, ancestor messages for you as well. Let's get some ancestor messages. Medicine Mother, honor your inner knowing. Okay, honor th that knowing energy that you have within you. Let's get another one. Great teacher, learn from your spiritual experiences also. Okay. We have our elder. Move beyond ancestral patterns. Stop doing the same shit so we could do something different and spark a change. I know. It's all about the rebirth and transformation. Release the old and rest. Okay, so get ready for resting period. Time where you should be celebrating within that resting period. Okay, also. Let's get some um soul messages. Some wisdom. From the soul. Yen. <clears throat> okay, connecting to that energy of abundance. Um, remembering that everything is happening for a reason. It's going to be like a, a like fork in the road where you got to choose. So choose wisely. Connect with your... Um, emotions and how you feel during this time. I feel like that's going to help you make solid choices. Okay, get going. Make action. Chop wood. Okay. Then we have chaos and conflict. Okay, so you can feel like you're just going through something over and over, but you're poised and you're ready to do something different. Just period. Time to go. Yep. So you're, you'll be making that You'll be making that adjustment as predicted. Let's get um, let's get any messages here and wellness concerning love. Kisses, the Grim Reaper. Okay, so Somebody could be trying to come back into your life, but I feel like that relationship is over. It's time to transform your life. This is what I'm getting. I'm going to pull three cards for this love message. Okay, seven of swords. Ace of swords. Mm -mm -mm. To the five of wands. Bottom of the deck and the ten of cups. Okay. Your peace is, is within you. You're trying to hold on to hang on to, to some lies and some BS. You know it ain't going to work. The shit is over. There's no second chances once, you know, people have broken our heart. This is a new year. Happy new year. Okay. Um, and we're doing shit different. All right. Excuse my language. Just period. Got to know it. All right. And that ain't nothing but the truth. Ace of motherfucking swords. Seven of swords. Ace of swords. Five of wands. Yeah. Bottom of the fucking deck is in what? Ten of cups. You finding that inner peace within you. You know what I'm saying? Your family is within you. Not outside of you. Right? Okay? And realizing that brings you true maturity and inner peace. Inner strength. Okay? And concern when it comes to your love. Let's just grab a romance card. There's something about a new love coming in with kisses. You know, falling in love, the card says. So let me just get a romance message before we head out. Let me see. Let me do some more predictions about this release. 
Honeymoon, children. Yeah, so it could be like children affecting your decision. Like if it wasn't you, just you by yourself, like maybe you wouldn't be making a certain decision or thinking a certain type of way. But it's like children might be in your head when you make a, a decision. Also, honeymoon. Someone's in a honeymoon in their relationship. Flirt came out. <clears throat> so there's a new person that you need to flirt with. You might not be giving this person no time of day. I ain't even gonna lie. I don't know. Divine timing is at work in your love life. Some Somebody is worth uh, waiting for. And I don't think it's the person from the past wedding. I don't think it's the person from the past. I think it's for somebody new. Like falling in love, that's a new action, right? Because whoever from the past, you probably already did that. So next. Anyways. Make sure y'all clear on these readings. All right. Express your love. Yes. Yeah, somebody is worth waiting for. Somebody is worth getting to know. Just period. Whoever this is. You're forgiving and learning. <laughs> Keep saying make the effort. Try, try, try. Because you're, you're, you're standoffish with somebody who's your fucking soulmate. <clears throat> I'm sorry for cursing at you. I'm in love with love. I'm Cupid. I, my bad. <laughs> But it is what it is. All right. I love y'all. I'll see y'all in the next one. Peace.